Hey guys, my name is Crazy Penguin, and this is a quick first impressions video for Medal of Honor Warfighter. Well, the multiplayer portion of the game, anyway. Uh, first impression, it's refreshing. It's been a while since I played a decent shooter. I've been playing a lot of shooters lately, and there are just some parts that they just got right in this. But at the same time, there's a lot of spots that they kind of overlooked. And it feels like the game could have been developed just a little bit longer. Some of the menus are a bit clunky, but overall it's a really fun game. The gunplay is nice. It's as good as Battlefield or Call of Duty. It feels tight and proper. I don't find myself getting annoyed that bullets aren't doing what they're supposed to. I'm personally a big fan of Twitch shooters, and, and by that I mean that I can't stand it when somebody takes more than four bullets to die. I like it, you know, first person on target generally wins the gunfight, that type of thing. It's pretty good, although there are some times I wish that people would still drop faster than they do already. Um, but I'm probably thinking that the guys who are getting healed by their fire team buddy are running around in a demo suit. I like the limited killstreak system, where you can choose at the moment whether or not you want defensive or offensive killstreaks. The fact that all the killstreaks are preset for the class is nice, it helps define their roles better. Some of the stuff is hard to control, which actually helps balance the game. Uh, if you were guaranteed a free kill every time, it wouldn't be nearly as great. No more hiding underneath the table while you rip the enemy team to shreds from above in a helicopter. Each game mode is nice, I took the time to run around and play the majority of them, and I only found one issue with spawning in one of them. Hardcore was fun, it wasn't annoying at all, I, you didn't feel gimped, you still had quite a bit of health, it even took multiple shots with my sniper to kill some people. And on that note, one thing I noticed is that the recon class doesn't feel very powerful. The zoom in time is nice and slow, I'm not a fan of quick scopers. The sway is nice, holding your breath feels right, my only issue is that outside of a headshot it takes two shots to get a kill and that can be pretty difficult. Uh, Talking about the first few bolt action sniper rifles though, I haven't unlocked everything yet obviously, and the semi-auto that I tried I wouldn't expect to be a one shot. But the bolt action sniper rifles aren't quite effective enough. The automatic secondary pistol is great, the proximity mines are cool, but I just feel like the sniper rifles themselves aren't quite powerful enough. Each class has a special ability of some kind, that's also a nice touch, it helps define their role as well. The signal scan allows you to see enemies through walls, and it's surprisingly not overpowered. It's quite loud, you can hear it almost all the way across the map, you know if somebody's using it, it helps you be aware of them coming. Whereas the ballistic armor feels like it absorbs just a little bit too much damage, and explosives are really powerful, so the grenade launcher that the assaulter gets is a little bit too powerful as well. But like I said, it also helps define your class, so I can pretty much look past all of it. All in all, it's a really fun game. It isn't perfect, and with Halo 4 and Call of Duty only a couple weeks away, it probably won't last long, but until then, I'm going to play the crap out of it and enjoy every second of it. It's going to do it for this one, guys. As always, feel free to click out, take a look at any of the videos you see on your screen. Let us know down in the comments what you think of Medal of Honor Warfighter. Hit that sub button if you haven't already, and I'll see you in the next one, guys.